Welcome back to my more important analysis videos on Friday 17th of August with me Richard Perry, market analyst at Handset Markets looking at dollar yen which is basically going sideways um, lost direction in the last week is broken that downtrend um, and moving sideways you've got a load of conflicting candles you've got the momentum indicators with a slight bear bias nothing too decisive around that for, I mean I've been talking about 45 on the uh, on the RSI and just sort of edging below that you'd say that there is a slight bear bias with that or negative bias MACD lines just edging below neutral and stochastic sort of camped around the sort of 30 40 marks so these sort of does suggest there is a slight corrective bias but nothing too decisive but it all um, I mean considering you've got the the run of lower highs um, and the resistance now at 114 so 11 at 40 is uh, is in place preventing a rally uh, this week um, but yeah there's nothing too decisive either way really on this chart and unless you sort of breach uh, or close below, let's say, one, uh, 110.60, um, which has been a bit of a base of old support. Um, but to be honest, you really need to see it below 110 figure, because 110 figure is a bit of a pivot, a bit of an old pivot as well. And unless you, unless you see it move below 110 figure, then I don't really see too much in the way of direction. 11.40 initial resistance at 12.15 is that key reaction high. So yeah, just basically broadly uh, trading sideways and waiting for a, uh, a catalyst really I think on this chart. So wish you good luck in trading and I'll speak to you later.